Hey, what is up guys? We got the Sonic going fast music, so we won't be reading all the cards out of this one. We're just gonna go real fast, get straight to the uh, good cards. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. Two boxes, let's go. Got my shiv right here. So it's even rusty, man. That's extra DPS right there, for sure. Oh man, did I blind you guys with the freaking light? I blinded myself, but this thing is so like holographic. Okay, Secret Forces, too good. Dude, I still can't believe in that first box. If you guys haven't checked out the first box, you missed out, man. Go check Go check the freaking first box. It was some next level streamer buff status stuff, even though we're not even doing this live. I should have done it live. Next time, guys, next time. I just kind of want to open these because I wanted to put the Vandys in a deck. First pack. Oh, well, they're even like backwards. Oh, what did we get? What did we get? We got the, uh, so again, same thing. I'm gonna put like the good cards, like right, right on our face. And then the cards that I don't really care about too much, like the Necro Gardeners and the Dwellers, because we have too many of those uh, over there. So we got a win out of that pack. Next one right here. All right. Virtual Cage, don't care about it. Ah, oh, we got another Shrit and an Exo Mirror. Oh, there we go. Ascending Soul, man. I'm getting a lot of those too. Cree. We got uh, a Elder. The old pervert, Master Roshi over there, a ritual weapon man, gotta increase the attacks. Oh, there we go, that's what I'm hoping for, alright, we, we pulled three vanities. Well, in two boxes at least, that's all I really care about. I had, I had ugly common ones guys, I was a filthy scrub, but uh, it's okay, now I have supers. The pet little fit. Oh, come on, heck yeah, dude. You send just where you at. I think that deck's pretty good, guys. If you're looking for a deck that's relatively budget, and I think that it's got a little bit of potential, I think the Ascenders are definitely a, uh, a great, great deck. Oh, we got another card, card D. Oh, that's a good card. Uh, I don't care much about that. Good to go. Oh, we got the Ascendu L. Oh, we got another Ritual Beast. I saw it. All right, so put that there. Vanny's there. All right. Uh, the Yosin, <coughs> was it training grounds? Oh, I haven't actually pulled, I don't think I've pulled too many of the Manjus. Oh, dude, heck yeah, dude, just give me all the Yosinjus. I'm actually stoked when I get those. Some people are like, oh my gosh, no more Yosinjus. Nah, dude. That deck can be really good. If they just come out with a few more support cards, I see it being really good. I mean, the deck is pretty much already uh, playable. And then we got the Ulti Kanaha. Alright, we got the L. Dweller, which we don't care about. We have too many of those. And we got another Decisive Armor. I feel like Decisive Armor is, so far, uh, we've pulled three Decisive Armors. Two. Heck yeah, dude. I think we have, uh, we just need one more comma two, and then we pretty much, I think we need one more comma one and one more comma two, and then we're pretty much done with the uh, Yosenjus. We basically have everything ready to go for that deck. And actually, I think we only got a one, one tanky, right? One or two tankies uh, so far, but it's not like we really need those tankies. <laughs> I, ha I have so many commons. But you man, you gotta have the foil ones. That's where it's at. Even though sometimes the uh, common version of a card uh, can be worth more, or there's like less copies. Because I guarantee you guys, this card will probably still be worth more, um, even though it's a super. But there's way more copies of the uh, super than there are the common ones. Because the common one was short printed, and I feel like this set is just gonna sell so so hot because of the uh, necros. That uh, wait, hold on, we can't we can't cover up the cleavage man. All right, cover up the face for sure though. Oh, we got another Unicorn. I feel like Unicorn Colossus are the easiest. Unicorn Colossus, Decisive Armor so far have been the easiest ones. At least from, you know, my experience. Oh, we got the Kaleidoscope. Already saw it too fast. I feel like we, I've already got too many decrees. I don't need to put them in there anymore. One thing that uh, you can do if you're a, a vendor at Yu-Gi-Oh! Sometimes you don't need to put the uh, expensive cards in your uh, case. Your glass cases or your binders. Uh, if you already have like 10 copies... You know, just keep them in stock, unless you know you're going to sell out of a certain card. In which cases, some cards do, for sure. But it just makes it easier for you to uh, not have to carry around extra cards that might not even sell, you know? 
Especially when you have like limited room. No way, dude, no way, no way guys. Is this really happening? Are we seriously gonna pull three Brian Axe and then get Trishula? Oh my, dude. Dude, dude, I I swear this isn't rigged, guys. Everyone's gonna think it's rigged. And then before we gotta give out the extra boxes, we just need one more Brynak and then uh, a Trishula, and then we'll give out the the box. So maybe it's happening, guys. I I don't even know. Maybe heck, dude, I'm building the deck now. I don't know. No, actually, I don't really have that much interest in playing the deck. Um, after I learned, oops, no, this is, this is amazing. Car, what am I doing? Dude, I don't even know how that happened. That's that's rigged, dude. That that was seriously. This is a rigged box. I swear, dude. <sighs> I don't even know how this is possible, dude. <laughs> I'm still just in shock of what actually happened. Maybe you guys were right, dude. Even though, like, I know a thousand percent you guys are, you guys are lying. You guys are wrong. Oh, dude, we got a die bog. No way, dude. This is also a really hard card to pull, and we got it. Dude, I love you. Dude, I'm telling you guys, it's it's freaking hacks. Oh wait, hold on. This card, I like this card. I like this card. I, I like playing three of it too. I feel like it's one of their best cards. And I feel like the deck pooped on Shadal is really easy because, um, well, that is unless Shadal's go first turn Winda and like you don't happen to have Elder, then you lose because <laughs> you need that additional normal summon. And that's too good though. Oh, dude, we got the Petal Dolphin. Two Brianax in two boxes. Is this? There's no way this is real. If we pull the other Brynak, dude, we should just give away a full, like, I don't really care about the Ritual Beast. You guys, you know what we're doing? If we pull another Brynak, I'll, I'll, I think I should be able to build a, a Ritual Beast deck. I actually kind of want to keep the Yosen Juice, uh, so hope you guys don't mind. But I'll give away a whole Ritual Beast deck. Because I, I had some interest in playing it, but if I can, like, have the, the Necros, then I probably don't even care about the deck. Uh, even though Ritual Beasts are getting more support. Um, sure, it's pretty cool. And same with Elder. Two, two more packs right here. So if we if we we have to pull Brynak and then a Trish and then this box is given away because I don't I have no interest in opening up anymore because I already got my Vandy's that was that was one card that I actually wanted to uh, actually get as well. Uh, Castor. Mm. Like I said, there's a cool combo with number ninety five, but other than that, no one really plays him. Uh, well, he he has this this card actually, guys, has a really high chance of being an amazing card. If they, you know, give Necros actually more support, but I, I don't know. I feel like the deck is pretty good as is, and I don't know if they'll print more. Oh, but wow, comma three. There we go. Okay, so I, I guess we're not gonna out that box, guys. I have to open it up, but that's okay, cause uh, I mean, we're still we're just one Brian Axe short away. If uh, dude, I'll give away a Ritual Beast deck. Ugh. You know what? What else we haven't gotten is Valkyrius. That's a card we need too. So, if I can just get one Valkyrius and one Brian Act, then we'll give away the Ritual Beast deck because then I don't need to like play other things. All right, let me just set these aside real quick. But man, the hacks was real on the double Bryo. Can we get triple though? One per box. The hacks is real. I'm feeling like we won't get any Valkyrius. So that card, like I said, is hard card to pull too. Oh, we got the the the, the Mossic. So that card doesn't seem like it's too hard to pull. Oh, another emptiness. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All right, we got the Shadow. We got the Soul Absorption. Vandy's emptiness again. An Ultia Paleo. Too good, man. I still can't believe that that that's so like impossibly hard, guys. You have no idea how two out of three boxes getting two Brianak. That's that's literally like a fake video. Like I'm not even kidding. Someone's gonna call. Someone's gonna say that I, I rigged it, dude. But I'm rigging it, I guess, in your guys' favor because, um, like I said, I'll be giving away the other cards. If you guys haven't checked out the first video, it's too late, man. Uh, well, you can still watch it. I mean, it's not too late to watch it. But uh, we did a small little like fun thing where I get away. Oh, what is it? What is it? Oh, it's another catastrophe. Oh, it, it, it is. It, is it catastrophe? No, it's catastor. Catastor. Okay. Yeah, but sweet. I got. I think I have a place set of the tankies now. Um, I think we're a few sh short of the ritual beast tamers. Oh wow, we own. We okay. I think this is the first time we've got one of these guys, right? The first time we've got a divine wind. Uh, that's kind of cool. Um, I actually like it. It's really good in the Yosendris. Like so broken in that deck. So broken because it lets you have a Yosendris that stays on board. There we go. Comma one. I think we we, we can build Yosendris successfully now. Wow. Where's the, where the, where the Valkyrius and Trish at? 
Alright. Oh man, my bad guys. Sorry, I kind of covered up the cleavage. Covered up the goods. Do okay, so pretty much, I feel like steeds is easy to pull in this. I pull a lot of steeds. Another of the, the freaking cards, I don't even care about these anymore. I'm gonna put them in this pile. Again, it's just because I, I don't want to have like, well, I don't vent anymore. It's just, it's habit though, it really is. When I used to uh, open up some of the uh, better boxes, and I used to buy a bunch of them and try to resell some of the cards individually for profit. And it's only really good to do it for the first few days. After the first few days, uh, usually uh, buying the, uh, well, it depends actually on the set and how many how many get printed. Like, Star Trek Blast, very hard set to come by. Um, and that had a lot of good cards in it too. We got Lara, okay, sweet. Oh man, we got, we got extra garden, extra gardeners for days. Hey, if you need some extra gardeners, dude, I got you covered. All right. <laughs> oh, we got another Yos Yosen training grounds. I don't know how many we pulled of those, but I th I'm pretty sure we got three by now. Another Manju secret techniques, come one and Puddlefin. So yeah, I should be able to <coughs> build that ritual beast deck really easy. I should be able to build all three decks. <clears throat> now with if I get three brown neck then it's it's over man. It's over. I'm done. I quit Actually, actually we have too many of those in that pile I still can't believe we got two Brian X out of two boxes so far. Maybe we'll get three Brian X in every box confirmed man. You heard it here first and you saw it There's no Illuminati fake stuff right here, and then with the the Herman Yokai Whoa, What is it? Oh, it's another unicorn Dude, everything at this point pretty much comes down to uh, the mirrors. I don't think we had three copies of each of the mirror. Um, some people don't like to play three of each. I, I, I don't really mind. Uh, Decree, I've got too many. That card I should save for later. I don't know. Now I know we have th for sure three Kanahawk in that pile. I know we have three Dolphins. Um, I'm not sure if we have three of the Apelios. We might have just two so far. Uh, I don't know if we have how many we have. There's two that look exactly the same. I think it's that Lara and Terra look relatively similar. I think Lara's got her eyes closed. All right. Oh, okay, we finally pulled another Divine Wind, another Catastor. I saw it already. That's the secret. Or no, I'm sorry, Decisive Armor. Whatever. Either one is just like well, Decisive Armor is usually played at one, if any. Some people don't like to play it at all, but the uh, the caster no one really plays that card at all. Um, oh, another you sent you? Heck yeah, dude! I'm pulling these sendus. I'm still happy, dude. At this point, I could get nothing. I I can literally open these packs and get ice barriers, and I'm still it's like I don't even know, guys. Like I said, actually I don't know how many L and R's we have. There's Lara, yeah, Lara's the one with the eyes open. So we got like tons of those, tons of those, tons of those. Uh, another dust size armor. Okay, sweet. Packs we got. We got three packs. Well, after this one, so I guess technically four. <laughs> all right, can we do it? Can we do it? Can we give out the ritual beast deck so I'll just have all the necros? Oh, I, I don't know, guys. We'd have to sack right here. <clears throat> okay, if we pull, if we pull a Brio, a Trish, and a Valkyrius, we'll we'll do. We'll give out the ritual beast deck. Because at that point, I'm pretty much satisfied. <clears throat> I don't think it's going to happen, guys. But I don't know. We already got two Brian X. So that anything can happen at this point. I feel like... Oh, dang, dude. We got the pedal of man. Chris Hansen, don't show up at my house. This dolphin, I swear, man. Why is this pack so awkward? It, like, open, it, like ripped up on the side. <clears throat> and these, these rigged packs, they've been already tampered with. In my favor, though. So I'm okay with that. All right, final card. All right, here it is, guys. Here it is. It's gonna be a freaking pedolphin run. It's gonna be a freaking pedolphin. All right, so uh, we got the that card. We got that card. Oh, oh, it's a call of solace. Okay, still not bad. I still can't believe we like we didn't get any Trishes, any Valkyries, but we got two out of three. It's the freaking Brian X. So that's pretty cool. So the winner for sure was someone that typed in Chris Hansen in the chat. I'll pick you out later because I filmed this obviously earlier. But anyways. 
Thank you, thank you indeed for watching, and I hope you guys pull some good stuff. Uh, I mean, dude, look at my luck, though. The hacks are real. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Let me know, what is your favorite archetype out of the three? Is it the Yosenjo, is it the Necros, or is it the Ritual Beast? For me personally, I feel like Ritual Beasts for sure are getting more support. Uh, Yosenjus, they should be getting more support. I'm really happy about getting uh, a Dybok. Uh, which is also, like I said, a hard card to pull. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day. Asianize, signing out.